promised to talk to a San and them super boys. How are we all doing? Boys, this is a video on how to make millions in GTS. Um, it's a hard game to make money in at the best of times. Um, but uh, there is a known uh, trick out there too to actually make quite a lot of money um, in the space of a couple of hours or even overnight uh, if you're willing to wait that long. Um, and you don't have to do anything. Uh, that's the beauty of this. It's not, I wouldn't say it's a glitch more than manipulating the system. Um, and I'm going to show you how to do it. Now, saying all that, if you get banned, don't blame me, okay? This is a full disclaimer. If you get banned, not my fault. So don't abuse it too much. Um, but it is a quick way to make a decent amount of cash, uh, especially overnight. Um, so if you are here and you're new to the channel, why don't you hit the like button? And if you're feeling really generous, the one we really want you to do is hit that subscribe button. And if you're feeling super, super cool, why not hit a comment? Write a comment, just right down there, hit a comment. And uh, yeah, let's just get straight into it. Uh, enjoy the video. So guys, what you're going to want to do is go to the arcade mode in the GT Sport menu and scroll all the way down to custom race. Once you've gotten into custom race, you're going to want to pick Northern Isle Speedway. It's the American track. It's the first one on the option list. So you're going to want to click that. It doesn't really matter uh, what time you set it for. Um, it's all the same. Now, what you're going to want to do here is pick the Mazda Roadster. Uh, it'll make more sense in a second. So once you've clicked that, it doesn't matter about the color. Click, click automatic. You're going to want automatic. Now, we are not doing a lap race. We're not doing a lap race. So you're going to want to turn that into endurance. Once you've gotten that and changed that over, you're going to want to go to the number of cars and reduce that all the way down to two. You're probably wondering, Super, what the hell are you doing? Well, it's going to make more sense now in a second. So once you've done that, scroll all the way down to boost and turn off boost. And instantly it's up to 21,000 credits. Rolling start doesn't matter. Uh, slipstream doesn't matter. Mechanical damage needs to be off. Make sure that is turned off. Fuel depletion turned off. Tire wear turned off. Um, scroll down to opponent category. Click into that and go the whole way down to GR1. Make sure you click GR1. And then go to opponent difficulty and select professional. After you've done all that, there's not much else left to do here. But I'm going to show you the uh, time limit. So this is where you can make potentially millions out of this um, this manipulation of the system. So for the purpose of this video, I'm going to do 10 minutes. But I'm going to show you what you can do if you were to go to bed. So say you're going to bed at night um, and you want to make a few bob. Uh, what you're going to want to do is scroll all the way up to... Um, Average sleep time, about eight hours. So we'll go to eight hours. Click that. 1.97 million. Okay. Now say, for instance, you go to bed and you wake up and you have to go somewhere in the morning. Go all the way across then to say 15 hours. That's how long you're going to be away from your PlayStation. And click on 15 hours. That's 3.690 million. Um, don't look at the 5.58 because you are not going to win this endurance race. We don't care about winning the endurance race. What we care about is getting that second place bonus. So once you've done that, so for the purpose of the video, I'm going to reduce it back to 10 minutes and then I'm going to start the race. So once we get to this screen here, you're going to want to start the race. Um, what's important to keep in mind, guys, is you need to be connected to the internet all the time for this to work. Make sure your PlayStation does not go into sleep mode. Um, the best way that I find a lot of people, what they'll do is, is they'll just turn off sleep mode on their PlayStation. I personally don't like that. Um, so what I do is I actually tie a rubber band around the back of the controller to press down on the accelerator key. Um, or the trigger, uh, so uh, R2 for instance on PlayStation, I'm not sure what Xbox, 
uh, is, but that should work the same way. Um, or you could use sellotape. Uh, sellotape works just as good. Um, but once you've done that, click start on the race and you're going to want to complete the first lap. That's important, complete the first lap. Once you've completed the first lap, you can just tie off your elastic band on the accelerator and go away from your PlayStation for a while. And that will leave it set up for you to basically go and do whatever you want. Um, if you're going out with your friends or you know you were going to sleep um, or you were going to the shops for a couple of hours. So once the lap is completed, what you're gonna to wanna to do is just let go of it and let it uh, ride along the walls. And then tie off your um, your remote to with the accelerator and it'll just continue to do this around the circuit so I'm gonna fast forward this to the end of the endurance race um, and then show you how much money you've made at the end Okay guys, if this happens, which it can happen from time to time, um, it doesn't really matter, but um, because the accelerator is pressed down so the PlayStation still thinks it's active, but um, if you so happen to be watching, all you gotta do is correct it and then go back to what you were doing. So I'm gonna start fast forwarding this again. Okay guys, there's only 10 seconds left, so I'm gonna cruise in with you. You need to complete the final lap, that's important. Um, it doesn't matter if you've walked away, because it will it will complete itself. Um, if your car has ended up sideways somewhere, um, when you come back and you check, all you gotta do is drive around one lap and you should be good to go, but it's important to remember, it needs to be connected to the internet. Well done, Mr. Bruce. Fair play to you. So as you can see guys, we got 61,500 credits, uh, we got 100 mileage points, that'll also go up depending on how many hours you have it set for, we got 15.9 kilometers, and we got 610 experience. And that's basically it guys, um, there's not much else to it, um, it's as simple as that, and it's an easy way to make a bit of cash overnight uh, when you go to sleep, uh, especially if you're struggling to get a bit of cash together. Um, it's handy that way. And yeah, if you've enjoyed the video, as I said at the start of the video, please do hit the subscribe button. We will be having a lot more GTS content here on the channel and we'll be going back to our Crew 2 videos soon and our Crew 2 streams. And uh, be sure to check them out. And uh, yeah, as you can see from the car that I'm currently using right here, which is a Toyota GT86, uh, I recently bought one. So why not check that video out? Link is in the description. Anyway, boys, without further ado, got a mean about us, August, Slanavalia.